my loves, how are you? I'm back again with another video and today I want to give you a review on a palette that I purchased not too long ago. I kind of showed it to you guys on my um, makeup collection video um, but it's on my channel. If you haven't seen it, go ahead and check it out. Um, this is a review that I'm going to do on the Makeup Geek um, Cuddling Lights Highlighter Palette. And this is a collaboration with one of my favorite YouTubers. Her name is obviously Catelyn Lights. And she created this beautiful, beautiful um, highlight palette. Hopefully you can see it. I mean, the light is it's kind of bad right now because I'm filming at nighttime. But um, I just want to tell you all about this palette. You know, obviously the trend right now, it's all the highlights and stuff. So she came up with this palette and um, if you don't know anything about Makeup Geek, she, Marlena, which is the owner of the company, she creates the most awesome, beautiful eyeshadows on the market, I think. I own a few of them and I just completely love them. They're super pigmented, they're super, super uh, buttery, easy to blend. Anyway, her products are really, really, really good. So when I heard that they were coming with a palette, I just was like, wow. And once when she uh, she mentioned that the formula on these highlighters, it's the same formula that she uses for her foil shadows, I was like, okay, I need to have it. I have, um, obviously, an obsession with makeup, and highlighters is one of them. So this beautiful palette comes with three shades. And the names of them are, let me show you, let me point it at you. So this is Sunlight, oh, the light is really, really bad. This is Sunlight, this is Starlight, and this is Nightlight. So this is like a, so this is the, the highlights that they created. And uh, this is 2.5 ounces, which is a lot. So I think, that for the price that you pay, which is $39, it might, for some it might seem like a lot, but considering the size of these highlights, it's like, it's a good deal. So, and the formula, believe me, it's amazing. So, um, what I did today is I wanted to show you how to use a highlight, and specifically how to use this. I incorporated my highlights, or all of these shades, into the um, eye look that I'm wearing right now. And I also obviously highlighted my face and I show you a few tricks that you could use um, with just single highlight palette. In this case, this one. So before we start, I just wanted to show you a few um, swatches. So hopefully you can see what the pigmentation is on these um, shadows. Okay, so right here. Oh my God. My light is like eating all this shimmer. I feel like I should turn it off. But if I turn it off, it's going to be super, super dark and yellow. Anyway, so I'm just going to place it right, um, right here. Hopefully you can see how pigmented and how beautiful these highlights are. So right there. Let me take this down but like this. And I mean, look at my fingers. It's like a lot for just one swatch. And I didn't go like crazy on them. My light sucks, really. Um, but anyway, so if you want to see the full on demonstration of this palette, please stick around. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you like this video. And I will leave all the information down below, the name of the highlights and the products that I use on the description box down below. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start. Okay, my loves, so I'm going to start by priming my eyes and I'm going to take my center stage primer from Essence and I'm just going to dab it all over my lids and I'm going to blend it with my fingers like this. Once I've done that, I'm going to set it with this Wet n Wild shadow and just a big fluffy brush. I'm just going to dust it all over my eye lid just to ensure we have a nice and smooth canvas. Now I'm taking the Anastasia Beverly Hills palette and I'm going to take this um, Golden Ochre 
eyeshadow with this blending brush and I'm just gonna start placing that all over my uh, crease this is gonna be my transition shadow and I'm just gonna blend it all over my lid Now from the same palette I'm just going to take raw sienna with the same brush and I'm just going to do exactly the same process, place it all on what it's called a crease but I don't really have much of it so I'm just trying to create a little bit of uh, dimension in that crease right above where my um, eyelid falls basically and I'm going to do the same on both eyes. Okay, to continue this process of building more um, dimension on my eye, I'm taking burnt orange with the same brush basically and I'm just gonna do the same thing all over again. Now I'm gonna take Railgar or Railgar and this is more like an orangey reddish um, eyeshadow and I'm just gonna dab that on my outer corner like so and then slightly bring it into the center of the eye i'm trying to concentrate most of it on the outside part and then whatever is left on my brush i'm just gonna bring it in for the fun part i'm gonna take the Catalina lights uh, makeup geek palette with the highlighters and i'm going to start with the center highlighter which is starlight and on this shadow brush, I'm just gonna dab that into my lid. And as you can tell, it's really, really pigmented. So it's very nice because it's, you know, it doesn't take as much product. So I'm just gonna do the same on the other eye. Now with a bigger um, shadow brush, Kind of like that, I'm just going to take the second shadow, which is the sunlight. And this one, I'm just going to kind of like place it over starlight, but more on the top tab. And I'm just going to try to blend that so there's like, um, you know, like a gradient effect. And as you can tell, the shadows are very, very pigmented. And I love them. Now with the smaller one, a smaller shadow brush, I'm just gonna take this golden one that is called the nightlight and I'm going to place that right on the center of my eyelid. So I just want that, you know, the more golden shade to be like the most brilliant of it, you know, like the most vibrant. So that's why I, you saw me uh, getting my brush a little wet with the fix plus and that's just to give it more intensity to the shadow and to make it look more metallic so as you can tell I'm using the three shades on this palette and they are completely gorgeous you can use it um, for any type of eye looks so I just decided to create this just to demonstrate that you know those things are versatile so now I'm gonna complete my um, I look by putting some lashes and you know doing the finishing touches. All right, my love. So I'm done. I already put on my lashes and I finished up my eye makeup, which is just basically what I added um, was um, blue liner. I got this um, I call blue liner from Wet and Wet and Wild, and um, I put it on my bottom lashes and I just kind of like smoke it out with a little bit more of a blue shadow so that's it I think it looks really good and the main focus of this is basically um, the palette from um, Cat and Likes and Make Geek so what I wanted to do is I wanted to show you how versatile it is and how you could basically use it for anything this palette is based on their eyeshadows, um, on their foil shadows, so they have the same formula. So basically you can use it as an eyeshadow like I just um, 
so show you um, but um, now we're gonna see how to put it onto the face okay so obviously I have my uh, makeup already like my um, foundation and I set it up and I did a little bit of a contour so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use uh, these two shades the pink shade and the golden -y looking one to highlight my face and I'm just gonna go back and forward like just dabbing it here and here these ones are super super pigmented and with a brush like this uh, this is the um, Morphe M510 what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna place it on the highest points of my cheeks hold on let me turn off my fan because this is gonna drive you guys crazy hold on so um, yeah just going back and forward and I'm just gonna put that right here on the highest points of my cheeks and um, hopefully you can see let me just step back forward a little bit it just gives you a nice glow um, I do have texture skin so I know it's gonna add um, you know show it more but I don't really care I still love my highlights so yeah just go with the flow so same thing on this side it's super 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 cute and super pigmented like look look at that right there I mean I don't know if you can see very well there you go um, this looks like a lot <laughs> to me so I just used those two shades mixed up and I'm just gonna keep them you know blending blend 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 so they don't look like I just destroy shrug <gasps> I can't talk like it doesn't just look like a stripe of shimmer on your cheeks you know so just like that and then I'm just gonna take the darkest um, well it's the darkest on the pan but it actually is not too dark so it's just very very beautiful um, shimmer color kind of like bronzy looking but anybody can use that color and I'm just gonna place it on the top of my nose and um, my cupid's bow okay so I'm just gonna zoom you out a little bit oh sorry appreciate so there you go you see how cute that shimmer is right there and on the cheeks that's very nice I really like it and I just take whatever is left on my brush and I just place it right in here so I'll show you already how to use it on your eyes as an eyeshadow um, I also show you how to put it on your face now um, the last trick that I want to show to you it's we're gonna use it in our lips so so um, I'm just gonna line up my lips I'm gonna use the regular nude color and this one is hmm, from NYX what color is this I don't know anyway I'm just gonna line up my lips with that Now for my lips, I'm gonna go with um, NYX lingerie, and this is on the shade Exotic. Mm, we'll see. I just got this one today, so I don't know how nice it is, but I like the color. Oh, okay. We'll go with it.
really bad at doing my lips. Okay, so anyway, got my liquid lipstick on. Now we're gonna take our palette, same palette that we used. You could use the same brush that you used to highlight everything on your face, or you could use a fan brush, either one. Now this is totally up to you. Um, grab any of the shades. I'm just gonna go with the darkest ones. What I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna place it all over my lips. Just like that. And I wanna concentrate it most on the center of the lips. So I didn't put anything on the sides like here. So it just gives you a nice metallic lip. But it's kinda like a gradient or gradient, I can I can say it. Um shade, you know, it's like it goes from dark to shimmery to super golden on the you know on the top. And I think it looks really cute. Let me zoom you in so you can take a look at these lips. I know my lips are not the best, but so there you go it looks very very pretty hopefully the light is not like taking all the credits away from this but um so yeah that's the makeup geek uh palette with collaboration of Kathleen likes which create awesome awesome highlighters uh anyway if you're interested in these i'm gonna try to link it down below um the price for this is 39 dollars so it's not too bad all right i hope you guys like this video and if you do please don't forget to give it a thumbs up uh don't forget to subscribe to my channel please please do so if you haven't done it yet and, and hopefully we can reach 100 subscribers soon enough all right and um well leave me any of your comments down below whatever you um want to say something just put it down there okay you know what to do so i love you my loves and we'll see you next time okay bye bye so busy, I'm talking. I mean, oh, what is wrong with me? I can't talk today. I'm so sorry. Um.